Bye, girls. It's Saturday. So, don't smack. I'm not smacking. We're on our way to Marshall's right now to find my graduation dress. If you did not know, I'm going to be starting high school in the fall. On Friday, Maddie challenged me to talk about my favorite movie. That was actually pretty hard for me. I couldn't really decide on a favorite movie. After a lot of consulting with myself, I finally decided on A Nightmare Before Christmas. My mom has a disapproving look. <laughs> I chose A Nightmare Before Christmas because I could literally watch that movie over and over and not get tired of it. I need the logo. I can log off. I'm not logged into anything. The camera's just on. Whatever. Um, I'm not. I'm probably not going to be able to film all that much in the store because they probably have a store policy on cameras. two dresses that I filmed, the only two dresses I filmed, those are the two that I'm going to get. I tried on five dresses, uh, and the ones, I didn't really film the ones I didn't like because there was no point wasting my uh, camera memory. We're going to Payless right now. We're not really sure if it's open or not. I hope it is. Happy late May the 4th and uh, Hanko de Mayo. Um, Hanko de Mayo? Yeah, you don't know what that is. I would have made a video saying Ha, like celebrating them but I have been taking exams all week and it's probably only going to get worse in high school with the uh, exams wise and curriculum wise I guess and we're going to pay less and I hope it's open and I cannot film them pay less because there's no dressing room where I could hide from the workers okay so now I'm at home uh, we just got back from pay less we only got one pair of sh one pair of shoes. There was like a what 50 or 60 year old Mexican lady at Ross, and it was funny because I would come out in my in one of the dresses that I tried on, and I would say mom mom, and my mom would come, and so would the lady, and the lady was like, oh you look you look fabulous, that that's so good on you, that looks amazing, and and, like, and so then at Ross we were looking for shoes before we went to Payless, and I found these heels. And they were like two inch heels, but my mom was like, no, 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 those are too high. So for like 10 minutes, we're going at it. Mom, these aren't too high. Grace, you're not getting the shoes. Final answer. And then this other lady comes and she was like, because we were, we were like going at it, like in the aisle, like of the shoes. And so this, this lady who was looking at shoes, she was like, she comes up to me. You have all this time to wear those shoes. Like you can gradually get to those shoes, but girl, you, you are too young for those. Your mom's right. Take it from experience. And her friend, her friend next to her, she was like, mm-hmm. I was blushing. I remember blushing so hard. And I, and it's weird because, you know, ethnic people don't blush. So I got, I got these shoes. They, uh, they have little roses on them and they're velvet. And my mom said, that's a sensible heel, Grace. And even then, those are a little bit too high. These are not too high. So because... Because uh, Claire left, and last time I challenged someone to only use five words per sentence, they say, uh, I want to use that challenge again because I really want to see what you guys can do with it. So, uh, whoever I roll has to, and I better not get punished for reusing the challenge because it hasn't been done. So, whoever I roll has to use only five words per sentence, like every single sentence they say, only five words. That's me. That's Maddie. Jack, I will see you tomorrow.